All right. Uh, it is 631, and I'd like to announce that this meeting of the Seguin Independent School District has been duly called. Notice of this meeting has been paid, posted in accordance with the Texas Opens Meeting Act, Section 551.043 of the Texas Government Code. We do have a quorum, and we will now stand for our pledges to the United States flag and Texas flag. <coughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible. With liberty and justice. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. <laughs> Mm. All right. Um, first up on our agenda is audience with the board, and we did not have anyone sign up to address the board this evening. So we'll move on to uh, item uh, 3A, which is possible actions to approve the use of iStation ISIP as our 2021 kindergarten reading screener. Hi, Mr. Cantu. Hello, good evening, Madam President, members of the board, and Dr. Gutierrez. So this evening we bring to you an item uh, about using iStation as the screener for the 2020-2021 school year. Uh, the Texas Education Agency this year asked us to use a new program, which is called TexKia. Uh, <laughs> we are using that for pre-K first and second, but for kinder, we decided to stay with what we've been doing, which is iStation, you all are familiar with that. Uh, the, the commissioner will allow that if we submit a waiver. There are some requirements that we weren't uh, prepared to launch this year uh, due to some of the setbacks with COVID, but we will be next year. So with your permission, we would like to ask for the waivers so that we can use iStation this year as we've been, have, you know, as we've been using it throughout the rest of the years. And then next year we will use TexKia as TEA is asking us to adopt. All right, are there any questions? If not, do I hear a motion to approve? I move to approve. Thank you, Mr. Amador. Do I hear a second? Second. Thank you, Ms. Duncan. If there are no further questions. All in favor, raise your right hand. Opposed, same sign. Motion carries 7 0. All right. Uh, next up in our agenda, we could possibly go into closed session. Dr. Gutierrez. Will, will this be necessary this evening? I don't believe so. Um, since we had the opportunity to discuss at our previous meeting. Okay. Then moving on to item uh, 5A, possible action regarding the sale, purchase, exchange, lease, or value of real property, including potential delegation of authority to the superintendent to make an offer or bid at auction on behalf of the district. We've all had a bit of time to look it over, look over the resolution. Is there any questions from anybody? No. No? If not, do I hear a motion for approval? I move to approve. Thank you, Mr. Amador. Do I hear a second? Mrs. Second. Moreno, okay. So we have a motion and a second to, uh, for action to, uh, give the Dela to for, regard to purchase uh, or lease real estate, including potential delegation of the authority of superintendent to make an offer or bid at auction. All right. All in favor, raise your right hand by your ear. <laughs> Opposed, same sign. Motion carries 7-0. And that is the end of our agenda, um, I believe. And Miss. Um, Moreno has asked for just a moment. She'd like to give us some insight, just a little commentary on what uh, she experienced with our TASB delegation assembly. Please note, these were just observations. I've never, I have never been a delegate uh, at the, the convention, but this was a first year and it was quite interesting. Um, 
it started or I logged on at 12.30 and didn't log off till 6.30 because of the, yes, Linda, that long, because of the virtual back and forth and having to vote and explain and have people talk uh, to their amendments that they had. But I found out several things. TASB has what are called cornerstone principles. And they, I went looking on the site to see if I could find the cornerstone, cornerstone principles to send to you all so you could read them, but they're nowhere where I can find. So I'm gonna to try to contact someone and say, okay, where, where can I go to, to look for these? But there was much discussion at this section of the, of the assembly about the promotion of equity eradication of systematic racism and the recognition of all cultures and races as we do our curriculum. Uh, and it, I found it, it was like over an hour and a half discussion just on this section. Um, those of you that, that logged on, I don't know if you had the opportunity to do the panel discussion with the MASBA group and then also the Black uh, association for Texas school boards, but there was a much discussion on that. Um, and what ended up happening is they inserted the word intentional eradication of systematic racism, which was something that was discussed back and forth the whole time. Then they also have advocacy priorities where TASB board members have come up with 10 items that they call upon the legislature to take note of and to address. And there was a total of 94 resolutions presented to us, uh, 55 were approved. And in those 55 was the one resolution that we submitted about the state, uh, state of test, uh, assessment test and that we not count uh, for the year 2020-21 and 21-22. Uh, so all of these resolutions will be moved forward uh, uh, in this next legislature. Uh, three were not recommended for adoption and 36 of them were duplicate. So uh, that's why there was only 55 that were um, a, a proposed and were voted on. So. It was interesting. All right, well, thank you. I'm sure we'll hear more about what's going on in the legislature and how TASB is representing us once January hits. Mm -hmm. Do I hear a motion to adjourn? I have a question before we adjourn. You know, the resolution has to be signed. Where, yes. When and where do we do that? Um, I have the resolution. I'm gonna take it over to Ms. Ramirez tomorrow and we'll let you know when it's ready for you. Okay. Actually, I think we all need to sign it. Yes. Yeah. So Nancy will be in touch with you. That's a good point. Thank you. So this resolution we all need to sign? Yes. Got it. Yes. All right. Um, all right. Motion to adjourn? Did I hear one? Motion to adjourn. Okay. Thank you, Ben. It's made all the motions tonight. Mr. <laughs> Jenkins is ready as well. All in favor? Raise your hand. Say goodbye with that same hand. And we'll see Adios, you all. Adios, everybody. Very